Jesus, Ricky, what's happening? It's the 18K. They're all over the damn place. They're trying to kill Uncle Bo. Shit.
Shut off the power. Uncle Poe is on life support. If we don't get backup power running right away, he won't make it. Okay, look, there's a control station down the hall. I'm on it. These guys are beginning to annoy me. Can we lock this place up? I'll take care of it. I got you covered. Yeah. Woo! Oh! <laughs> 
think we're clear. That was close. Nice work. No, man. We just got lucky. Where was our backup? Now, who was looking out for us? <sighs> Fuck. No one ever looks out for you in this town. I don't know, man. Feels like the game has changed. Used to be a brotherhood. There was a code. Even amongst rival triads. Now we're killing each other at weddings. Even in a fucking hospital. And for what? Shit. Let's get out of here. More cops. Get out, get out. We don't. There's a lot of them. I'm beginning to dislike them. in war. Yeah, but against who? Those guys were 18k. And I'm starting to wonder. A lot of people stand to benefit if Uncle Poe never leaves the hospital. He might walk out of there alive. I hope so. You know, but Dog Eyes is gone, and this shit keeps happening. It might be that someone is pulling strings, trying for a move that lands him in control of the triad. The 18k are getting out of hand. We have to send them a message. Damn straight. I'll drop you here. Cops might be watching the place. Hey, Ricky, keep it tight. There aren't that many decent guys left in this gang. All right, all right, see you, bye. Another hit and run. Uh, poor guy got thrown by a car. What are you doing here? What's wrong? What 
You in the habit of challenging doctors, nurse? I'm saving lives. What are you doing here? So sorry, doctor. My policy is running down people. Sang is doing a lot of kidney transplants. Where are you getting your donors, Sang? You catch those gunshot victims the other day? A couple of them. I can't believe someone shot up a wedding. just to get organs for an 18K ring. Tang, it's Wei. What have you found? I've got the doctor. He's doing a lot of transplants off the books, and he's got ties to an 18K red pole. I planted a bug in his office. You should be able to listen in on him. Tang, it's way. Stay on that wiretap. I expect Sang to be doing an emergency kidney transplant at any minute. He already got the call. But wait, they picked up the donor too. It's Calvin. Your friend, Calvin. Shit. I have to warn him. They're saying he's in Central. They're already after him. But wait, you can't let him see you. The only way you'd know he's in trouble is if you're a cop.
make me kill you. Okay, I got him. Pull in Dr. Sang. You sure? Tragic story of modern medicine, Inspector. Not every patient makes it. Way? I'm leaving this guy in the parking structure off Quark Street in Central. Make sure you send someone to let Calvin out of that trunk. Dr. Sang confessed. He's done more than 20 transplants for 18K in the past two years alone. The guy gives urban myths a bad name. He'll get 10 to 20 in maximum security. When you consider that all his victims were triads, I wonder how long he'll actually serve. 18K won't be happy, but I'll personally sleep a lot better knowing he's not out there. Doesn't bring back your friend, but I think it's fair to call it justice. Well, well, look who decided to join us. Yes, yeah, good to see you. Come on in. <laughs> you sure you don't want to fuck her a little before you start? It's no problem at all. I'll just have a swing by your hotel on the way to the studio. <laughs> nah, man, I'm good. But we could do a photo shoot or whatever, and look, I'm sure it'd be fun and all, but that's not why I'm here, dude. 
Ah, you don't know what you're missing. This baby will fuck you in a way your wife never could. Sonny, this is Way. Way? The infamous Sonny Woe. <laughs> That's me. Infamous and notorious. Glad you could come by. Ricky's told me all about you. This is Kay. What's good? He's producing Vivian Liu's next big hit. Yeah, it's gonna be hot, man. Way here's the real deal. A bona fide tribe killer from the streets. Cleavers, guns, castrations, whatever you want. Okay. <laughs> Way, why don't you take King out on the town and show him around? Yeah, anytime. It's like one big playground, man. Nothing's off limits. You want to pick up some girls, get nasty, done. And with Way, no one will bother you. Nobody fucks with Sun on Yi. Yeah, well, I mean, actually, that sounds all right. If you don't mind showing me around. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I wish I could go with you, players. But business calls. All right, cool, man. Yo, it was real nice to meet you, Sonny. Let's hit the streets. Let's do it. Ricky, listen to this. I've been thinking. We need to get her a movie role of some sort. Hey, I think we'll start at the K-Bar. The VIP room should give us what we need. Hey, it's your town, man. And so you producing for Sonny? Yeah, just this one time. And that guy's a piece of work. Fucking clown, you ask me. <laughs> I'm glad you said it first. Buddy does good business, makes everyone a lot of money. But as far as his personality goes, huh? <laughs> good to know we're on the same page. Fact is, you know, I got some other business to discuss. But I don't think my partners back in the States will want to be in bed with that guy. What kind of business? I got friends. Guys I grew up with. They got a real good import and retail thing going. They could use a good Hong Kong and access to that good Asian product, you feel me? That's the reason I took the producing gig was I heard Vivian and the label had connections. Who they are? To me. Uh -oh. <laughs> well then, I guess this is gonna be like one of them old school business meetings. You know, when you show me around town and try to figure out if we're a good fit, Like the VIP karaoke room? It's right this way. Good to see you. Yo, hold on. Now don't tell me you and me are gonna sing to each other. I mean, I'm here for the local flavor, but not that local. Let me find us the right kind of audience. Hey there. What's your name? Katushka. I'm Wei. But listen, I saw you looking at my friend, and I figured you realize he's a famous American celebrity. And I, I just wanted to ask if you might keep him a secret. <laughs> Ooh, how can I say no? Well, if you're not doing anything, maybe I can buy you silence with a drink. Want to join us? That's very nice of you. So you're from Russia? Yes. <laughs> How'd you guess? Ah, call it a hunch. Oh, you. <laughs> Here, have a seat. I'm gonna find a few more people to join us. Hello, ladies. Hey, Mr. VIP. Want to buy us girls a drink? <laughs> I don't know. My friend and I are gonna enjoy your company? Try us on and see what you get. <laughs> All right, why don't you join my friend in there? I'll be in in a second. You okay, miss? Hey, what guy? That my girl. Why do you fuck off? I'm son on ye, motherfucker. Now get out of here before I break every bone in your body. Oh, uh, man, no. Sorry. I didn't know who you were. The guy seemed like he was getting a little pushy. We get that a lot. You work here? Yes. So, you allowed to join the customers for a drink? Oh, that sounds nice. By the way, I'm Wei. I don't think I've seen you here before. I'm Iliana. Yeah, yeah. I usually don't come to places like this. I'm here for my friend. Well, if you ever want to hang out at places not like this, let me know. I'd like that. Can I call you? Sounds good. Thanks. Give me a call sometime.
damn way. <laughs> Who knew Hong Kong was full of such beautiful women? <laughs> Friendly too. How do you not know Hong Kong have beautiful girls? You just had to come to the right place. Well, I expect you girls to make sure King never makes that mistake again. <laughs> you can count on us, baby. We love American men, <laughs> don't we, Tina? All right, Wei. <laughs> Why don't you show us what you got? Come on, Wei. Let's see those lungs. <laughs> uh, I'll show you mine if you show me yours. I can see you fitting Damn, right you in are, in the I've States. I've been waiting for you, a stable yeah. guy. Stand back. You want to change the scene. Stand back. Ah! You crazy? This is icing on the fucking cake. Tell my boys, I got the man for them. All right. They'll want to start slow, but I'm guessing they can move as much product as you can ship. But this could be huge, man. These boys got some big ideas, too. I'm talking all the legit shit their money goes into gotta go somewhere. You feel me? And the feds back home are really cracking down. Brothers might be looking for a little offshore stash. Yeah. And the man who set that up and kept it safe, yeah, he'd have a whole river of green to deal with. Feel me? I could swing that for you. I still got contacts stateside who could set up the other side of things. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. Yo, you ever work in movies, way? Nah, too much bullshit. I mean, look at Sonny Walk. Nah, man. Come on, that's what's good about it. Everybody's a fucking moron. You come in with muscle and money, and you too can call the shots. You got a point. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Really. It's real cool to meet you. We'll see you around. Yeah, for sure. Hopefully first night of many. Well, then. Looks like this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. <laughs> All right, man. Take care.
<laughs> I don't mind you fucking her is one of the perks, but she has to understand the consequences if she disappoints me. Are we clear? Of course, Sonny. You're not getting attached, are you? A man of your caliber? You don't need to worry about that. I hope not. Way, come in, have a drink. You ever fuck some famous pussy, Way? Not yet. Maybe one day. <laughs> it's a trip, man, let me tell you. You drive by one of those billboards the size of a building, and you tell yourself, I'm going to her place, bend her over the table, and mm, and then you do it. There's no other feeling like it. <laughs> yeah, okay, uh, speaking of stars, I need to go pick up Vivian. Let Wei do it. You and I have more business to discuss. How about it, Wei? Think you can handle a smoking hot starlet for the day? Uh, sure. I, you know, as long as Ricky doesn't think I'm moving in on his territory. <laughs> nah, of course not. Here, take my car. <laughs> you take good care of my little starlet. Go ahead and fuck her if you want. Just don't damage the goods. Tell you? No, I was expecting Ricky. Everything okay? Everything is not okay. Is it wrong of me to want to see my boyfriend? Why do I have to put up with this? No, Vivi, it's not wrong. And you put up with it because Ricky loves you. But... But what? Since your boyfriend isn't driving, I get to sit in front. <laughs> Why are the bad ones always so good looking? I'm Sandra. What's your name again? It's Way. Ricky talks about him a lot. Oh, all nice things, I'm sure. And you're here to basically do whatever we want? Uh, something like that. What do you have in mind? Hmm. Do you have steady hands at high speeds? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I can provide references if you like. Um, are you trying to talk him into one of those street races you always go on about? What's the deal, Way? You a gangster like Ricky? He's not a gangster, don't say that. Let's say I'm as much of a gangster as Ricky. Oh, that's too bad. Recently I've wanted to date a gangster. Well, maybe I'll see if I can find one for you. That would be nice. What's Ricky doing anyways? Why is he too busy? I don't know. Something with Sonny. Sonny? That guy's a creep and a perv. Sorry, baby. It's okay. What? What'd he do? Nothing. But he tried. I was at a party on Wallace Chung's yacht. That's him, that's him, pull up. Hi, Alex. How are you? Huh. This is your new boyfriend? Not yet. Why? Are you jealous? Of this guy? Hey, so Sandra says you like to race. How about it? Now, if you win, I'll let you take the girls home. Way? I'm not sure how much that's worth. Okay, we race for the girls and a hundred thousand. Sure, I'll take your money too. You racing with the girls in your car? The extra weight will slow you down, idiot. Think of it as your head start, Alex. Because you're gonna need it. Think of it as your head start. You'll find each other and die law. I'll show him. <laughs>
<laughs> My heart is beating so fast. Great. <laughs> Steady hands. Gotta give you that. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, get a room, you two. Oh, shit! The police! Oh, cops, perfect. The police! The police? Are they after us? Oh, no! Don't worry, it'll be fine. Exciting plan. <laughs> I'm all excited out. But you can take me for a drive anytime. Well, I might just take you up on that. Oh, get a room, you two. I think that's a that's a bit later. Oh, you are a confident bastard. I like that. But I'm promising nothing. You take me racing, and we'll see if you have what it takes. What? This wasn't enough for you? No, it was good. So I want to do it again. You see. I find something exciting that I like to do, and I want to do it again and again. All right, all right. Well, maybe, but I doubt Ricky will lend me his car again. Oh, well, get another car. Well, I might be able to do that. Oh, that's it, just over there. Fun way. <laughs> Thanks. Anytime. Vivi, give Way my number and tell him he can take me out on a second date. <laughs> Sandra says you can take her on a second date if you want. <laughs> yeah, I got that. Thanks. Thanks for taking us out today. It was my pleasure. Yeah, sure. What's going on? My friend Katushka. She's gone missing. Nobody's seen her in a week. Katushka doesn't have a visa. She's... she's illegal. Girls like her go missing all the time, but usually they don't have anywhere to go for help. I'll check it out. Would you? Oh, thank you. Can I help you? For some tea? I like yum di ta. Thank you. Tu Jin Sao seems to be getting very comfortable in his new position as temporary chairman. 
too comfortable. I hear that he is already planning to make it permanent, should Uncle Po not recover. Well, Big Smiley will kill him before he'll let that happen. Indeed. And that would allow Lee to take over the Sun on Yi himself. But that can't happen. No, it cannot. Tu Jin must go. Dan Hai, he must not be removed by force. He must step down on his own, after which there will be an election. Why would he step down? Tu Jin likes heroin. So far, he has managed to control his habit. Dan Hai, anyone who indulges as he does, lives permanently on the brink of an abyss. Nah, I've arranged for the quality of his supply to improve. And now, you will give him a nudge. Over the edge. Okay. How? He is an immensely superstitious man. Ho Mai Sun Ga, obsessed with Feng Shui. He cannot bear to have the slightest thing out of place for fear of the misfortune it will bring. And you want me to... Make sure his luck turns bad. Very bad. <laughs> I like your style. I will. Hey, what's your problem, kid? Mrs. Chen want you to talk a bit. He told me to tag along. Give you Feng Shui advice. Feng Shui, ah! A lot of people are in fire. Feng Shui is huge and... Whoa. They said you were dangerous. I didn't think they meant you were driving. <laughs> you believe that? Yeah. I've been spending a lot of time reading about ghosts to make this stupid natural. Want to make sure nobody I kill can hurt me. <laughs> you know what I mean. Goodbye, Mr. Chow. Have a nice day. Nah, right on schedule. Usually go scamming at this time. Two chin loses money fast. We better hurry up. Now we can do that. We'll find a way in. Come on. Okay. It before he comes back and heads will roll. Oh shit, I haven't seen it. We can do that game. Wait here, I'll open the gate from the inside. There's ghosts that don't like him. What about those vases? Good idea. Maybe just leave it. <laughs> number because the word sounds the same as <laughs> death in Chinese. <laughs> Should we try something? <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. 
See that clock? Set the time 4.44 and unplug it. That'll freak them out. 4.44. Yeah, this could work. Oh, yeah. His phone's like as fuck now. <laughs> Turn the piano so faces don't go away. I help, but I put my... I love my crutches and what it used to be. I'm at the law. Chin's gonna freak! Either he think ghosts fucking with him, or he knows his home isn't secure. <laughs> Somebody come in, we better go. Mr. Chow, is that you? Anybody in there? What are we doing? Just hide. Stay calm. Anybody in there? Hey, is everything okay there? It looks like Mr. Chow forgot to close his gate again. I'm gonna get something to eat. You want anything? You ordering food from the Golden Koi Group? I'll be right down. They're gone. Come on. Gage here. Tuchin loses his money fast. We better hurry up. Call you old salty crab. Uh, well, that was this restaurant guy who owed me money. Couldn't pay. He told me I could eat for free at his restaurant until he paid. That way, I wouldn't cut off his hand like I normally would. So crab was the most expensive thing on the menu. I had that every night for shit. I think he's home. Get down. Could it one year? Those cards must have been rigged. I never had a game like that before. Never! What told me single governor? Why why didn't you stop me? It's your job to protect me, isn't it? Fucking rodents. All of you. What is this? Galator. Look at this. How can you let this happen? It's all gone to shit. Gone to shit. What do you want us to do, boss? Get out. Get out. I need to think. Turn her out. Wait. The guy left that car. That's a jacket. Wait, wait, wait. Let's take the guard's car. Damn well, I always wanted to get myself one of these. <laughs> one of these? <laughs> really? Ah, yeah, okay, bad idea. You're a strange guy, you salty crab. Thanks. That means a lot to me. In. See you later, kid. Old salty style. <laughs> Hello. Wait. Miss Jane. How are you? Uncle Pope. He's dead. We're 
arrangements for the funeral. Things could get, uh... Complicated. Yes. I'll be in touch. Of course. Whatever you need. How'd the date with Vivian go? You want to be her new boyfriend? <laughs> Relax, Ricky. I'm just making a joke. So, wait. You know Fifi Miao? You mean the movie star? Yeah, I heard of her. What's she doing these days? She's doing another movie in the Stripper Assassin franchise. But I want the role for Vivian. That's a great idea. That would be huge for Vivian. Yeah, it would help her profile. Aren't you going with Vivian to the release party? Yeah, you're right. Good call. We're releasing the track that King produced tonight. You have a great time. You and the hottest star in Hong Kong. Go, have fun. You know Big Smile Lee? Oh yeah, we've crossed paths. Good. We've got a joint venture making porn. He brings the girls, I bring the production and distribution. That's good money, I bet. Yeah, if Vivian pisses me off, that's where she'll end up. But there's more money if I keep her a star. I just have to make sure she doesn't flake out on me. I want you to put some cameras up in an apartment. I need it done right away. Can you organize that for me? Yeah, of course, Sonny. I'll take care of it for you. Okay. Here's the address. There's a box of stuff over by the elevator. Excuse me, sir. I don't think I've seen you before. I'm a location scout. Could you let me have a look around? 
Only residents and their guests are allowed, sir. Now be quick. I'll make it worth your while. No. It's not going to happen, sir. You have to leave the premises, sir. We have to send him a message. I don't know what his problem is, but we don't have to worry about it. Did he know who you were? <laughs> yeah, you should have seen him. We should get out of here soon. Oh, wow, that sounds nice. You look beyond I'm beautiful tour, tonight. Be done in Every time I looked at you, you know all I could think was, <laughs> I can't believe she's real. Oh, Ricky. She's too perfect to be real. Seriously. Every woman wanted to be you, and every guy wanted to. <laughs> well, you know. Oh. Ricky, you have such a one-track mind. Shit. Fuck me, Sonny. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> you know I like that. Okay, <laughs> but let me go freshen up first. Whatever you want, baby. I'm gonna go have a smoke. Yeah, hey, Sonny. <laughs> nah, nah, everything went great. Yeah. Yeah, he was there. He was impressed. Yeah, you should have seen him. <laughs> exactly. Fucking second rate. Oh, and now that you mention it, maybe I should check up on her.
Pendrel, there you are. Are you fucking crazy? What the hell were you thinking of wrestling Jackie, huh? Oh, I thought we were past all that. I just wanted to congratulate you on that business with Tang. Good riddance. Now, what about Sonny Woe? Anything new there? What about Jackie, huh? Fuck, Pendrel, are you deaf? No, Officer Shane, I'm not. But you clearly have forgotten who you're speaking to. Way. Forget about Jackie a moment. Whatever we can get to stick to Sunny Woe will obviously hurt Big Smile Lee. And we both want that. Fine. Sunny had me put up a hidden camera in Vivian Lou's bedroom. She and Ricky nearly caught me. He always did have a reputation for that sort of thing. Think you could get a copy of that? Are you fucking kidding me? She's got nothing to do with this shit. This could be the piece that we're missing on Sunny. Can you get it? All right. But I want Jackie in return. Cut him loose. Very well. Get me the video and he walks. I'll get it. All right, I have to go. Get me that video as soon as you can. I hope you're happy. Vivian? What are you doing here? Well, Sonny says you've been really helpful to him. And to me. And I just wanted to thank you. Vivian, no. Wait, wait. What's this about? N nothing, I just... I just can't. God, Sonny's gonna kill me. Wait, Sonny sent you here? Yeah, don't you know that... Know what? I, I just... I can't do it anymore. Sonny will just... Sonny will just have to get another girl. Look, Vivian, you don't need to. Not with me, okay? So... You mean you're okay with it? <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Wow, you're... You're the first guy who's ever... I mean... Thanks, Way. Way, did you bring the video? Jackie? Done. This should be all I need to put Sonny Woe away for a long time. And with Uncle Poe dead... Wait, how'd you hear about that? Good news travels fast. I'll have Raymond arrange your debriefing. Congratulations, Way. What are you saying? I'm saying it's over. You've done your job. It's time to come in. It's not over. Not yet. Way, the sun on Yi is seriously crippled. Your mission was an unbelievable success. I must admit, I thought you'd be happy. Big Smiley will take over. It'll be even worse than it was under Poe. I can't come in now. I'm not finished yet. I understand your personal reasons for doing this, your history with the Sun on Yi. This is why I selected you. 
But you've done more than enough. Those are my orders. Fuck your orders, and fuck you too, Penju. I came on to take down the sun on you, not to shuffle the deck. Shen, you're making a mistake. What do you want? Your friend Jackie. It's agreed he'll be walking out of Joe in a few minutes. Just thought you might want to be there to pick him up. Thanks. Don't mention it. See you, man. Thanks for picking me up. <laughs> you joking? Of course I'm gonna pick you up. You're my boy. You okay, Jackie? They treat you all right in there? Yeah, I'm okay. I got lucky. Someone convinced Ming's brother to say it was a loan. Was that you? <laughs> nah, I wish I thought of it, though. Some lady cop wanted me to turn snitch. Tang something or another. I told her she could go fuck herself. <laughs> Smooth. You heard about Uncle Poe, though, right? Yeah. When's the funeral? Soon. We should go get ready. Let's go. Eh, I can't go to a funeral like this. I look like shit. I need a suit or something. Alright, pick something up. Hey, uh, so what's the deal with that cop? Lady. Huh. Said she wanted to help me turn my life around or something. Said if I started snitching, she'd help me out. Anyways, man, forget that bitch. These are the latest. Perfect for you. Elegant, but not too flashy. You know, I never thought I'd be able to afford a suit from a place like that. It sucks that I have to get it from. What happened to Uncle Poe? I don't think anyone knows yet. Yeah, I bet it was the 18K. You gotta make those assholes pay it finally. If it was, it would mean a war. Shit. Used to be, I'd think that was cool. Now, man, I'm not so sure. The one thing about prison gives you too much time to think. Yeah? I don't know about this life anymore, you know? I mean, it's not like I'm cut out to do anything else, but sitting in there, shit. Now we're going to a funeral. Where's the funeral? Ah! I do. I've been thinking about that myself lately. Might be time for me to make a change. Maybe going to business with Jill May. Nothing big, but what the hell? Maybe all that talk about being a big deal was just... What? Bullshit? Just bullshit? Yeah. Right.
Nia, what the fuck are the 18K doing here? They're here to make a show. Or maybe to start a fight. All the Sun on Yi leaders are here in one place. I don't think they expected the police to be here, though. <laughs> Never been happy to see the cops before. Hey, where the fuck is Sunny? Sonny Wo, I've been looking forward to this moment for a long time. Yes, and it will make you look so good to your bosses, they might even pat you on the head like an obedient dog. Right up until the time that I walk. Again. Not this time, Sonny. Come on. Don't get your fancy shoes all muddy. Let's go, boys. We got what we came for. We're leaving. Hey, you! You can't do this here! It's a fucking funeral! Goddamn police! Why don't you show some fucking respect, huh? Why don't you? The 18K are about to do this city a great public service. And anyone who stays here deserves everything they get. The cops are leaving? What the fuck? The 18K are going to- This is gonna get bloody. Come on. Shit, here they come, man! So these motherfuckers what it means to be so on ye! Oh shit! It's We have to deal with 18K and with the police. All right. We need a plan. Where's Tu Chin? He's in seclusion. Seclusion? He's in a hotel somewhere, riding the white tiger, that fat fuck. Perhaps you are right, Brother Lee. With Uncle Po gone, we now need a chairman who can lead us through this. Finally, you're making some sense, Chuck. I am the strongest. I am the most feared. I say I should be chairman. Hmm. Perhaps temporarily. We should go Wait. with... Wait! We need to have a proper election. That is the way it has always been done. It's the sun on you, cold. Ha! You, a woman, talking of cold. You should never have been allowed to be sun on you. But I was, and my contribution to this organization have been significant. With respect, I have to agree with Sister Jane. We need to restore stability and order, and that means clear thinking. 
We should follow our tradition. Our tradition? You've only been on Sanonyi for a short time. What do you know about our tradition? Nevertheless, Sister Jang and Brother Shen are correct. Fine. We'll have the fucking election. But I'm warning you here and now, making anyone other than me the chairman will be disastrous for Sanonyi. Everyone has a vote. Our tradition allows... Fuck the tradition! Ricky! It's out. Concern you. Kill him. Dump him in the harbor when you're done.
Do you think it's over? Not yet. They have some weapons in the trunk. You better take them. Thanks. You better lay low. Wait, what's going on, man? Shit, they're Mrs. Ch after everything we got. Who do these fucks think they are? Big Smile Lee's coming after us. I guess he figures we can't vote against them if we're dead. Big Smile Lee? Yeah. You want out? No, I'm with you all the way, boss. We're with you, Wayne. Just for once, I'd like to fight someone outside my own triad, though. Go check it out. You stupid bitch. Where's Wei Shen? I got a message for him from Big Smile Lee. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Just the piece of shit I'm looking for. You're going to vote for Lee, you hear me? You don't? We're gonna fuck you. All your ancestors and ancestors. <laughs> These guys don't give Get up. Come on.
I gotta get to Ricky. I don't want him on Big Smile Lee's side. How are you gonna bring him over? I got an idea. nothing to say to you. Calm down, okay? Listen, Big Smiley's coming after anyone who's a threat. I work for Sonny Woe. We're Lee's biggest backers, and unlike you, I'm loyal to my friends. Sonny told me about you and Vivian. What? Ricky, I didn't do anything. I swear it. But... Sonny recorded a video of us together to blackmail me, and now the police have it. They're threatening to release it if I don't testify against Sonny. What do you think Lee will do to her when he hears? You said no? Of all the people Sonny told me to be with, Wei is the only one who said no. The only one! Even you, you didn't say no. Listen, Ricky, you have to choose. If you back Sonny, Lee will probably ask you to kill her yourself. Or you can get her out of here, keep her safe, and Sonny stays in jail. Okay, okay, but what about Big Smile Lee? You let me worry about Lee. Listen up. You better keep a low profile for a while. Yeah, yeah. All right. See you. Hey, it's Way. I need a car. 
A car? Takla! I'll be there right away. Here you go. I hope this is good enough. Thanks. You got a lot of nerve after that shit Pedro pulled at the funeral. What, he sent you to finish the job? Pedro doesn't know I'm here, all right? I'm completely violating protocol. Look, I never wanted you for this job because of what Dog Eyes did to your sister and how you handled things in San Francisco. But you've done better than anyone could have expected. I can only imagine the pressure you must have been under. Don't get sappy on me now, Raymond. Wait, you crossed Pedro. Right. He's cut you off. And this is your last chance to come in clean. What? But what's he gonna do, arrest me? Call me a road cop? Look, I need you to be straight with me. Is he gonna blow my cover? Look, I don't know what he'll do. Not anymore. Wait, just come back with me now. You're a good man. We can fix this. Smooth it over with Pendry. Jackie, not now. I'm busy. Jackie, I need to go. Wait. Wait. Try anything and your friend dies. Oh, he's clean. Where's Jackie? Go ahead. The man is down there. Don't be afraid of me! 
is Jackie? You're never going to find him! Stop! Stop! Where is Jackie? I don't know! I don't know what they did with him! What do you mean you don't know? I was just supposed to kill you. I don't know anything about the other guy. Who does? D.Y. Agent K's head enforcer. How do I get to him? I don't know. I only talked to him by phone. You tell me, and I might let you live, you stupid fucker. I only talked to him on my phone. Here, take it! <laughs> oh! Who the hell is this? Where's Horseface? This is New Shoes. I work for Horseface. I'm not talking to you. Put your boss on. He's dead. Shen killed him. What? Shen killed him. Plan didn't work. What? What plan? Who is this? I don't know. I hope you're not afraid of ghosts. This is Way. I need a boat and I need a gun. Can you meet me in Kennedy Town? And Salty, make it a big gun, okay? I don't want to fuck around.
you back. Fuck! Fuck! Duh. Wait. Thanks, bro. How'd they get you? Man, it was Big Smile Lee, man. He's grabbed fucking grab me at the fucking funeral. Toss me off the 18K, man. Yeah, they used you to get me to an ambush. Big smiley. Fuck is worth the dog eyes, man. Fuck. We'll get him, Jack. Come to the election. Tell the others what happened. That'll be the end of me. Man, I don't want anything to do with any of this shit anymore. Sit on ye, broken nose, Lee. I'm done with all that, man. You dream about me in the sun on ye, you know? <laughs> What do you want to do now, Jackie? The election's tomorrow. We'll want to check out the building, make sure that Big Smile Lee isn't planning any surprises. But we got some time to kill. I don't know. I almost bought it today, man. For real. I think I'm just gonna go take a walk or something. Got some shit to think about. Sure, man. It's cool. I'll see you tomorrow or something. All right, don't do anything stupid.
Jackie. Jackie. The fuck. Oh fuck. Oh my god. Jackie. Ah, fuck. Jackie. Ah. Ah. Should I say, Officer Shin? <laughs> My name is Mr. Tom. Perhaps you heard of me? Fuck you! I'm no cop! Your friend Jackie didn't think so. He was most loyal. But then, I expect you wouldn't have told him anything. You must be a very dangerous man, Wei Shen. Son of a bitch, I'll kill you. Oh, save your energy, Mr. Shen. You'll need it. The last cup I had in this chair lasted almost 48 hours. Would you like to try for a new record? I understand your personal reasons for doing this. Your history with the Sun on Yi. You do what must be done. There were rumors. Before I'm done with you, you will confirm them. And then you will die. That's what worries me, Wei. You're one of them. That's the attitude that makes us strong. Loyalty. Discretion. Zhang will be disgraced, and Big Smiley will be elected head of the Song Hong Yi. Call me when he comes around. There's no rush.
I suppose I should be impressed. You defeating my men like that. I am not. Now. Where were we? Oh, I see you've cut your way through the amateur. But now amateur hour is over. <laughs> now you die. Your determination is impressive. Fuck <laughs> you. Anyone other than me, the chairman, will be disastrous for Sunday. You are an officer of the law, same as me. Wait, if you have a problem with me, then let's sort it out ourselves, okay? We don't need to bring her into this. That's the answer that makes us strong. Loyalty, discretion, used to be more common. I'm here for Mr. Lee. I take it you've heard of Big Smiley. That's what worries me, right? You're one of them. Wait, you cross Pendrel. He's cutting you off. Anything happens to me, you look after my people, okay? Man, it's Big Smiley, man. He's got fucking grabbed me at the funeral. Toss me off the 18K, man. Show your true colors tonight, brother. Oh, God! I'm sorry, please! Please! No! 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 You must stop this fight at once. We must be united against our true... Oh, 
I'm gonna die, Lee. Huh? Fuck you!
You were supposed to die with Winston. Dog eyes blew that. And that poke guy tong. <laughs> Fucking worthless one, girl. But that's okay. Because I am gonna enjoy killing you myself. Fuck you. Hi, <laughs> Tor! <laughs> Easy their way. This man is in my custody. Yes, sir. You okay? <sighs> yeah. <sighs> Where's Pendrew? He's up for promotion. Interpol. He's done with us. <sighs> He's dirty, Raymond. He outed me to Big Smile Lee. Take it from me, Wei. Whatever you heard, it won't matter. The only voice they hear is Pendrew's. You did what you came here to do, right? Let's get you cleaned up. What the hell? Ah, uh, Superintendent Pendrew. I'm surprised to see you. Uh, you're the one who chased my boys away? Oh, you know why I'm here. I can imagine all sorts of reasons. Uh, I'm sure you will tell me. I'm moving on to greener pastures. But not without taking care of some unfinished business with you and Sonny first. We had a deal, did we not, Pendrew? I gave you the three tigers. It made your career. And I let you and Sonny continue operating. A sacrifice you were willing to make at the time. I'm putting Sonny away, and with you gone, I'll finish this once and for all. The only difference between you and me is... I know what I am. Jesus Christ. Pendrew, I've got you, you son of a bitch.
What would you like me to say? Whatever I did, I made Hong Kong a better place. I served the greater good. But you, you let them get to you. You abandoned your duty, officer, and became one of them. You deserve to be handed over to Big Smile Lee. Did I? <clears throat> well, Penju, I guess everyone gets what he deserves, including you. You ready for life in prison? What? Because all your old buddies are going to be waiting for you. I made sure they found out what you did to Uncle Poe. That's a fucking death sentence. I know. Where you can't. I won't last a day in there. That's the plan. Inspector. Officer? I just wanted to say thanks. For what? It's me who should for be... For helping me close cases. Do something I could feel good about. Hell, for helping me stay sane. My pleasure. So, what are you gonna do now? I don't know. Job's over, but... I don't really have anywhere else to go. <laughs> Strange to say it after all that's happened, but... Hong Kong kind of feels like home. Yeah. But which Hong Kong, officer? And what about Wei Shen? He proved himself to be loyal to me. One way or the other. And isn't that what really matters? Leave him be. Yes, Anjie. Drive. <laughs> <laughs>